hey guys welcome to the channel or welcome back okay okay so my name is Sadie and I make um grad school content here on YouTube uh, as well as daily life content and lifestyle things so if you're interested in that subscribe um, this is a little uh, life update because I haven't seen you guys in a minute and um, kind of like a life update with a um, semester one of grad school recap so I have my talking points on my phone so I'm looking down okay um, because we're back with the camera hello alright so to start um, the reason I fell off with filming um, was because school kind of picked up and I was trying to stay up on my schoolwork as well as you know life um, but yeah so I have a new job that's like the first like big update I now work with a healthcare company that um, specializes in all aspects but I'll be working with the older um, the older adult population as a caseworker slash CBS specialist so TBS just stands for therapeutic behavioral specialist or support and then specialist um, so I'll just be helping them like get through their daily emotions and the things that they might want to work on emotionally because a lot of the clients I see have um, mental health issues so yeah I'll be helping with that um, I just started that job so I'm like not even a month in so it's kind of really new and you'll see because the next um, thing I'm updating uh, the next thing I'm uploading is like a vlog um, just kind of a week in the life of a TBS service specialist whatever um so yeah i'm doing that um i was supposed to be transferring schools um i was gonna go from cleveland state's clinical mental health program to a online only program but that kind of fell through it didn't work out the way i wanted it to so i'm still at csu um i don't know if i'll be able to transfer i don't think I will be able to so for the time being I'm just gonna stay at uh, Cleveland State University um but I just hate being downtown I really really wanted it to work to work out but I guess you know it just wasn't in the cards um so <clears throat> a lot of that being said that's basically it that's basically the only things that have changed um I'll still be working as a GA so I'll be working uh Monday Wednesday Friday as a, a TBS specialist with my new job and then I'll be working Tuesday Thursday with my old job which is a graduate assistant um, at Cleveland State and that kind of works out because one of my classes is um, in person one of my classes is in person and it's on Thursday night so that works out um, so yeah one of my classes is um, zoom Based and it's on Saturday mornings and then the other one is completely online and then the one that is in person is a required class um, so I'll be able to do that one after I get off of work so um, semester recap uh, semester one went really good like I got all A's go for the class, go for the class. yeah I got all A's so I just I don't really have too much to like worry about it was difficult managing the classes um just because sometimes I fell behind um but other than that I think I did pretty well for the first semester um transitioning into working two different jobs will be difficult so I have like beefed up my uh, time management skills a little bit because I want to make sure that I'm doing my job as the best I can and still being able to see my family and friends and getting the grades that I want to get so all of that combined is gonna be a lot and that brings me to my next point um, my number one tip or like a piece of advice for people going into graduate school um, is to get a planner um I know that some people don't use planners as much as others but have some form of place where you can write stuff down and like keep track of everything because you're gonna need it like no matter how much you think you can slide by if you're working get a planner because it's essential like if I didn't have my planner 
I wouldn't have been on top of everything that I was on top of and I don't think I would have gotten the grades that I did um so that would be my main uh, piece of advice for people going into graduate school or any sort of like higher education because in undergrad you can kind of scrape by it's not the best and I don't think it's great to not have a planner but um yeah in graduate school there's like things that you have to keep up with outside of school so that would be my main piece of advice and then also like keep up on your readings because the few times that I didn't do my readings which I wasn't a heavy textbook reader when I was an undergrad so it kind of was a really hard transition for me but whenever I didn't do my readings it would be detrimental like I would not know what was going on in class so I would suggest that you stay on top of your assigned readings and yeah I think that's it I hope you guys enjoyed this video um I know it was a short one but I did want to life update you guys because I'm going to upload a video soon about my new job and the anxieties that I have behind that so look forward to that um but I will see you guys in the next one and thank you all for watching I really hope you enjoyed bye